Just when you thought your day really sucked. You suck. Here comes something to make it suck even more. It's a Lamont and Tonelli podcast. Well, hey, Sully, we are rock and rolling today. Look at this. Oh, yeah. Kevin oh, yeah. Nealon is in the studio. How you doing, Kevin? I'm doing great, thanks. It's good to be back here with you guys. Yeah, we haven't had you here in a while. What uh, They were saying like 10 months or something? Probably about 10 months, maybe more. Yeah. Yeah, could have been nine months. <laughs> <laughs> Might have been. Might have been. Yeah. 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 Never, never but know. this place has not changed one bit. I see you have four pennies in front of me, like just kind of tucked away in the corner. Those are still here <laughs> from the last time. That is, by the way, you're sitting normally where Sully sits. Okay. Yeah, that that would explain a lot. Yeah. Our super producer there. That, that's why you, you see the big bottle of hand sanitizer here, too. <laughs> that's for our guests. <laughs> wow. Wow. This How you been doing, like, man? It's like a kid's bedroom in here. <laughs> <laughs> I'm doing good. You been busy? Good. I've been busy. I mean, I'm working on the road. You check my website out. You see that I'm working almost every weekend. Yeah. And, you know, in 1987, yeah. the year after the first year on Saturday Night Live for me, Wow. Yeah. I went on tour with uh, Dana Carvey and Dennis oh, wow. Miller. Yeah. We did about 30 city tour. And uh, and we're going to do a few more dates uh, coming up soon. We're going to do uh, the Tropicana in uh, Atlantic City on May 25th. And then Foxwoods in uh, Connecticut on the 26th. And then we're going to be doing Saratoga here. At really? The, uh, uh, Mountain Vineyard. Mount, yeah, yeah Mountain Vineyard. Winery. Yeah, Winery. Yeah. And, uh-huh. uh, that's in July 26th. Wow. And then a couple others. Yeah. So that'll be fun. Oh, we that, that sounds so. It, do you, how often do you talk to those guys when you're not? Uh, I talk to Dana every like maybe once a month. Yeah, and uh, Dennis, I you know I do his radio show once in a while. But and and, um, and some of the other people, I, I saw Spade uh, the other night. I run into him once in a while, David Spade and uh, Schneider. I see sometimes. I love it. You know, that's about it. And what about Adam Sandler? Sandler, I see you know uh, once in a while. Our kids go to the same school, so I see really? him a lot. Yeah, yeah. You're working with Sandler at all coming up? Uh, yeah, I'm doing a film with him called The uh, Blended in South Africa. Is South that, what is Africa. That all, what's that yeah. all about? That's... Uh, Drew Barrymore is going to be in it. Yeah, and I think they sh- they're shooting it there because it's uh, there's a tax break or something. Yeah, you know. It's so amazing. does he have you doing something goofy? Because every time Sandler puts you in a movie, he makes you do something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's yeah. always embarrassing and humiliating. <laughs> um, you know, I was uh, in Little Nicky. I played Tithead. I had, I, had, I had breasts on my head. You know, these were actually they looked real. They looked authentic. I mean, they had a good makeup department. They had prosthetic breasts on my head, and they filled them with condoms full of water so that they would jiggle. And everybody loved me. They wanted to talk to me. And I said, hey, my eyes are down here. They're not up there. <coughs> and, um, and then when they took the breasts off at the end of the day, nobody cared about no me. One I lost did. all my power. No, I didn't even exist. So what are you going to be in Africa? In Africa, I'm playing a guy. Uh, I have a very young Asian wife. Yeah. And I have a child from my previous wife. Mm-hmm. And, um, and everything is positive. <laughs> you know, it, feeling it, it's good, it's all good, working it, feeling it, loving it, you know. Oh, that's so fun. Now, you know, that's where Sully's from. Maybe he can give you some tips. Yeah, Sully's from uh, Tanzania. Yeah, from Africa. Is that right? Yes. yes. Do you know um, a guy named Luca? <laughs> I think he's from there are Tanzania. so many Lucas there. <laughs> Are they all like you there? Yes, <laughs> most of them are like me. Yeah. yeah. And what kind of language do they speak? Swahili. Swahili? Yeah. Is that made out of soy? <laughs> <laughs> I got nothing. Oh, Zulu. Yeah. Oh, Zulu. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you got to watch those Zulus. <laughs> Swa- what does Swahili sound like? Swahili sounds like uh, no- normal it? language. Can you, can you, like a normal language. language. No, it doesn't sound like a normal language. If it sounds Say like something anything. in Swahili. Yeah. Yes. How about Igani? Okay, yeah, do that. Yeah. How about it, Gunny? How about it? <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, did, did Gumbo. 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 Well, not just words, Gumbo. Sully. Get, yeah. Put together, yeah, yeah, put together a little sentences. conversation. Have a little conversation Mambo with them. Mambo Mazzuri, Appa. Keep, <laughs> didn't you be jumping up and down when you say that? <laughs> now, Sully, Sully, you were telling me uh, getting ready for this appearance because Sully's like your biggest fan. Yeah, yeah. And uh, you're telling fan. me you saw him on TV the other day. You know, I watch a lot of TV, Kevin. <laughs> I, I didn't know that. <laughs> do you do a lot of nude scenes on yes. TV? Yes, I do. Because for a man thing. of your age, you look good. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> what did you see me nude in? <laughs> was it weeds? Yes, it was weeds. Dude, the nude scene oh, yeah. in weeds? Oh, yeah, quite often. <laughs> 
Yeah. Yeah, I'm pretty chiseled. You're are, you comfortable, <laughs> are you comfortable with that? No. <laughs> no. You're known as the snake in the weeds, I tell you. <laughs> <laughs> no, I've never really had to uh, take my shirt off in anything, um, mm. except for that show where I had love scenes uh, mm-hmm. with various people, and actors, <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> and with myself. <laughs> <laughs> and those people were women, I hope. <laughs> uh, yeah, for myself. That's a Sully ad lib right there. That Boy, is, he had libs. He called Sully at his finest. That's his A game right there. That is, that's as good as it gets around here. Oh, what else do you watch, Sully? Huh? Sully, tell what him what you watch. watch. Uh, let me say it in Swahili. Oh, good talk about that. Sully, what do you watch? Uh, a lot of movies. A lot of movies. Yeah. What's your favorite movie? Robinson Crusoe. <laughs> Robinson Crusoe. <laughs> You're looking at him and go, what did I walk into today? And do you have a flat screen TV or is it one of those old Trinitrons? Or? No, flat screen. <laughs> Remote control? Yes. Uh, nice. He loves the cooking shows. <laughs> yeah, the he cooking really shows does. Good. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Who's your favorite chef on the cooking show, Sully? Mario Batali. <laughs> Now he sounds like he's talking Swahili again. <laughs> it really does. <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah. So what is your name in Swahili? Swale. Swami? Which, which means clean. Swami is clean? Yeah. Well, that's, that's, that's ironic. Number. Yeah, that is a good number. <laughs> <laughs> well, it doesn't mean deodorant, I'll tell you that. Uh, what, poor, yeah. what, what does Kevin translate in, in your language? In Irish? Yeah. Kevin is actually... Uh, a, in uh, Gaelic, I think it is. It's uh, something about kind gentlemen. Okay. Okay. Are you kind? <laughs> really? Kinda. <laughs> <laughs> oh, poor Kevin's like, I got up early to do this. <laughs> <laughs> he never thought he'd be interviewed by a guy <laughs> from Africa. <laughs> This is a good uh, kind of an entry thing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So we're, I'm looking forward to this trip because uh, we're going to be filming at a place called Sun City. Uh-oh. And you remember that place during apartheid? Yeah. It was banned by a lot of performers. Exactly. But that was then and this is now. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> now you get a tax break. Yeah, now you exactly. get a tax break. Uh, by the way, Kevin is playing Uh-oh. Cobb's Comedy Club this weekend. <laughs> uh, uh, you're playing Friday and Saturday. Uh, two shows on Friday, two shows on Saturday. I've seen your show before, and I, th- I don't know if I've ever told you this. Um, uh, I went to one of your shows, and I took Uh-oh. my uh, sister-in-law, Uh-oh. and she ended up getting married to a guy that she met at your show. Are you serious? Yes, absolutely. <laughs> well, they're divorced great. now. But <laughs> <laughs> Did they get divorced at my show? <laughs> no. no <they> didn't. <laughs> How long were they married? Uh, they were married for about 10 years. Oh, so this is a while ago. Yeah, came. yeah, absolutely. Oh, so wow. you have uh, very fond memories for our family. Yeah. It is. That was that. They must have come to the marina or down to the cannery when it was down there. Uh, you know what? I think it was uh, actually. You might even remember this. Uh, a hotel decided to do a comedy show, and they rented out the ballroom, and you were performing at the ballroom. That sound at, familiar? At one of the fancy hotels in wow. in San Jose. San Jose. And it was uh, it was a pretty cheesy setup. It didn't last long there. No, I'll tell you that. That's why it's nice you're at a nice comedy club now. Yeah, well, this is pretty special. <laughs> this is special, yeah, for me. <laughs> I usually do ballrooms. <laughs> yeah. You know, and Lithuania clubs. <laughs> Lithuania. Tough room. Yeah, those are tough. Uh, I'll tell you what, you're one funny guy. I'm, I'm, no, sometimes I'm two funny guys. <laughs> but mostly uh, when I'm with Sully. <laughs> uh, Kevin Neal in playing Cobb's Comedy Club. Thanks for coming in here, man. Thanks for having me, it's, man. It's, it's always... always it's always, always a, a, a surprise. Yeah, <laughs> you got that right. <laughs> hey, Sully, good ad libs today. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what he's drinking, but he seems to be having a good time. You know what we may do? We may send uh, Sully down to your show, sit front row. Oh boy, I better bring some disinfectant. Look at all the look at all the Lysol disinfecting wipes he has, and just around him, antibacterial stuff he's, uh, he's drinking. Don't drink that. Go for the water. <laughs> Kev, thanks for coming oh, in here, man. man. It's been great. <laughs> Another fine product from...
Uranus. That concludes the Lamont and Tonelli podcast. To hear more and everything Lamont and Tonelli, check out the website at lntworld.com. <laughs>